Okay, so um, I've basically finished doing my synopsis of my form. Um, While researching about each and every one, I came across the, uh, the typical things you find in romantic comedies. And um, one of the things I found is you have the typical boy meets girl scenario. Um, it's inevitable in a romantic comedy. You have to have it in there. Separate people, they meet, come together, they build a relationship from there. And yeah, that's that's what happens. There's always, always got to be a typical boy meets girl scenario. Um, also, inevitably, a happy ending. It has to have one. If it doesn't, it's a tragedy or a drama. It's not a romantic comedy at all. And there has to be relationship at the end of the film. Uh, um, also, another one is there's often some sort of sexual innuendo that's within the play. For example, friends with benefits, they decide to have no strings attached sex, but that's a form of them as characters building a relationship together. So, uh, here's an extract, and, uh, hope you enjoy. Don't laugh. This could be great. This could take all the weirdness out of it. Well, we talked about this. I don't like you like that. I don't like you like that either. That's why it's perfect. <laughs> I don't even know if I find you attractive. That's cute. Mm, like, do you have a thing for jerks? Wait, well, do you even find me attractive? That's cute. No, no, no. Before you got to know my awesome personality, strictly physical. First time you saw me. There's just two people talking. Yeah. Two girls over drinks at Bennigan's. Go. I liked your eyes. I didn't think I'd ever seen such big, beautiful eyes. Your lips. Yeah, thought you might be a good kisser. I am. <laughs> your breasts. What about them? They intrigued me. Really? Yeah. Oh, I think they're so tiny. Still breasts. Thanks. I liked your hands. Mouth. Butt. Voice. Chest. Eyes. You said that. I meant it. Okay. Normally, a romantic comedy is set in an urban environment. Um, generally around a workplace where the two characters meet. Somehow they bump into each other. One someone's boss. Um, etc, etc. Mostly in an urban area. And the clip I'm going to show you now is from Coming to America by, uh, it's got Eddie Murphy in it. And uh, the scene is the first time he meets his uh, his dream girl, Lisa, in, uh, in a workplace, actually. He gets a job. So, yeah, have a look. Hello. Hi. I am Akeem. Nice to meet you, Akeem. I have recently been placed in charge of garbage. Do you have any that requires disposal? No, it's totally empty. Well, when it fills up, don't be afraid to call me. I'll come take it out most urgently. That's good to know. When you think of garbage, think of Akeem. Well, um... I have to get back to my sanitation duties. Maybe we'll have a chance again to talk on a professional level. Goodbye, Akeem. Another generic code that I have found is that humorous dramatic stories are often centered around romantic ideals such as true love, and romance, and they have to overcome obstacles. Last night I had a dream about a dream about you. Yeah, yeah. You know this. Now every time I think it seems to be about you. Yeah, yeah. This is beautiful. One minute I was over love A second later I was a part of us Who is she? Who? Where girl did broke your heart? Come from? <laughs> this is like a girl broke my heart Why am I in love? What did I do? Is that your girl? Yeah, 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 yeah
left that alone. Sorry. Last night I had a dream about a dream about. As you can see from the uh, the clip that I've chosen from Think Like a Man, which came out in 2012, um, obstacles again, such as bro broken heart, finding true love. That's what that scene was all about. Him exposing to her that his heart has been broken, and he's looking for love. I mean, throughout the film, this character he puts a facade on as a player, finds out. This is the woman for him, reveals himself to her, and they come together in the end. So, yeah, one of the uh, the conventions and things that frequently occurred was the uh, overcoming obstacles. Stay with you.